Welcome to the fourth video in this series, which looks at how you can give really amazing erotic massage and touch. If you haven't already done this, I recommend watching the other videos in the series, which I'll pop a link to in the description box. So let's dive into the fourth professional tip that I'm gonna give you to help you take your intimate and sexual experiences to a whole new level. I'm Libby at Touch of Happiness Massage. I'm a body worker and an intimacy coach. I teach couples and individuals how to give and receive intimate and sensual massage and have more relaxation and connection in their sex lives. Find a position that lets you, the giver, be relaxed and comfortable. Too often, when I see people giving their partner a massage, they believe that they have to be working really hard or enduring somehow. They're straining their bodies tight and contracted with effort and subsequently they get tired. Giving massage isn't enjoyable and that is felt in the body of their receiver. So many times in couples sessions, I've seen the receiving partner tense and on edge and when I ask them what's going on for them, they reply, well, I just feel like he's really uncomfortable or I'm worried and I feel like it's not okay for her and so I'm distracted and I can't relax. We then make a small little adjustment for the giving partner and suddenly it clicks. I see both their bodies soften, their breathing deepens and the receiver starts to connect with relaxed pleasure. When your core stabilizing muscles are activated and tense, that overrides the sensory input from your hands, meaning that you won't be able to be as responsive to your partner's body. If your torso and core are soft, and supported, it's easier to breathe and relax your hands. Check out the first and second videos in this series on those topics. So your touch will be more connected and in tune with your partner's body. Ultimately, it's your receiving partner that needs to be the most comfortable, so don't let them adapt to you. Allow them to get comfortable first then to ensure that you can both stay relaxed give yourself some back support sit against the head of the bed or lean up against the sofa on the floor um, use plenty of cushions behind you and under your butt and your knees use a meditation chair or just invite your partner to sort of drape themselves in your lap so that you can both be mm, comfy soft little cats experiment try things out to find what works for you um, for some inspiration check out my online courses in genital massage which offer demonstrations and options of different sitting positions to help you both be as comfortable as possible for more ideas and tips that will help you to feel more relaxed, present and pleasured during sex and intimacy, remember to hit those like and subscribe buttons and you will never miss a video.